Okay, uh, let's try to solve this problem two gram. So uh, let's read this problem statement first. So two gram is an ordered pair, a string of ring two of capital Latin letters, Latin letters, for example, A Z, A Z, A Z, A Z, Z A. Three distinct two grams. So you are given a string S consisting of N capital Latin letters. Your task is to find any two gram contained in the given string as a substring, as a substring, two consecutive characters of the string, maximum number of times. For example, B B B A A A B B A. The answer is two gram is B B, which uh, which contain S in three times. Okay, so B B is contained three times, one times. This is two times, this is three times. And that is a, a two gram substring which is contained most of the times in the most frequent two gram in the given the string S. And BA is one, BA is two. BA uh, contain twice, AA contain only once. So BB is the answer. So we really want to find the number of uh, the maximum occurrence of substring two gram. So we are looking for it. So uh, it is very easy question and the constraint is very uh, low. So the problem is very easy. You can use the map to find the frequency and we will find the two order like two, two consecutive characters as a, as a string. And let's try to find the frequency of each two, star, two gram strings. So any two gram means like any substring which is contain consecutive two character. And uh, in the frequency which has maximum, that is the valid answer. If the uh, if, if if two uh, two uh, substring like AB or BA contain the same similar uh, output like similar frequency, then uh, print the only line contain exactly two capital Latin letters any two gram contain in the given substring uh, maximum number of times. So if they are same, then you can print anything. So let's try to do it. Okay. Let's try to implement the code. So uh, just put the input in and then took a string S, C, S, and we'll get the map. And we really want to put the key. Map has two value, key and value. The key will be uh, definitely string and the value is uh, our integer, uh, which is L. Double L is my uh, means long long. Okay. So let's try to for LLI equal to one. I less than N. I plus plus. N is the length of the string. Then string uh, S1 equal to S of I plus S of I minus one. That would be a string. You can print C out S1 array and M S1 plus plus. So let's try to find it like all the all the two grams. You can print it. Okay. Then uh, after that, you can easily get auto well of man. So auto x m c out x dot first and x dot second. So x dot second will get uh, the number of frequency and x dot first will get uh, so here s of i plus s of i minus one. Okay. So nothing. So we really want to do something like to string s1 then s1 plus equal to s of i minus 1 and then s1 plus equal to s of i so a a a b and every time you are going to get string s1 s1 must be empty every time so every time you are getting s1 equal to empty That it will be very simple.
here we can easily find the x dot first and x dot second. So see that we are getting everything a b. The first uh, two gram is a b, then the second two gram is b a. We are getting uh, here. See you can get the all the frequency. So the maximum number of times definitely a b is two, b a is two. You can print anything if you want. And the here the jet jet the maximum frequency. So let's suppose uh, LL maxi equal to zero. And a string answer. So here, uh, if x dot second greater than maxi, then maxi equal to x dot second and answer equal to x dot first. And this will be answer. C out x dot first. A C out answer. Again. And you can remove this part. And it will be very easy. So through map, you can understand how to traverse the map in the using for each loop. So we are getting this. Let, let's try to submit the proof. Our code accepted. Uh, let's mark it. Get the green part and uh, 